How's it going, Mike? Hey, Murph! Xenoblade! Blade to Xeno! That's your name! Yeah, close, no. actually. Xenoblade Chronicles X. The MMO that's offline. What does Destu mean again? Uh, yes, it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It is. It there's, is there's some, like, uh, wacky anime character that's in Destu Destu Destu, like, really fast, and I thought it was really funny. And then when somebody told me what it meant, I was like, oh, it's not as funny. It's no, it's kind of a little tick. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's a I got, sexy I got, anime. Yeah, I got sexy girl. I got mech man. Mech man. I've got casual guy. And we've got the most important character, oh, Tatsu. Tatsu the potato. Uh, wait, you have so you have racist guy. Oh yeah, because he's on a mission with me. Oh, are you on that mission? Ah, uh, maybe. Maybe. Uh, so this is Xenoblade Chronicles. I've gotten pretty far. I think I got actually a little bit farther than you, Mike. You've actually got much farther. I'm level thirty-three. Yeah, I'm level fifty-ish, and I'm kind of done with it. Anyway. But yeah, oh, the voices in this game. Yeah, you know what? There are two races in this game that have really bad... So, other than those two, it's not so bad. But these guys have, like, little squeaky voices. Right. And then Tatsu is the potato there. Yeah. And... Uh, so... You don't have to have Tatsu if you don't have Will. Oh, really? Yeah. But she's one of the main characters. I have her in all the time. I know. That's the problem. <laughs> also, she's required for literally all the things. Yeah, for all the story missions. Yeah. So. I'm gonna go pick up a random mission and let's go try it. All right, cool, yeah. So one of the good things about this game is there's tons of missions. Yep. One of the bad things about this game is you should take as many missions as possible. Oh, there's your max. Yes. Yeah. You should take as many missions as possible because it is almost impossible to do these missions. Hey. Yeah. And it's uh, not that they're hard or like they'll kick your butt or anything. Yep. It's that you need to find some random thing. Uh, go down. Let's do like a bounty. Like if we, let's see if we can find a. Uh... Yeah, that one's easy. Oh, oh shit! No. Yeah, you did. All right. Well, let's look through the missions that I have. And do you have like a a, a tyrant mission? Uh. I like the tyrant ones. Where tyrants in this game are just basically big dudes. Uh, there, that guy. Slay... Oh, that's, uh, that's gonna be rare. It's gonna show up. That's the annoying part. Sometimes stuff doesn't show up during the whatever. Uh, let's see... No, no... Uh, no... Mm. Hey, go back. There you go. Alright! And then, so, the neat thing about this game that we can't show you is that the game, this actually yeah. makes use of the gamepad. Quite a bit. For like, for like, as like a kind of a HUD to get like maps and jump. So now you're in your mech, your cool mech. We. This game without the mech is not as awesome. Not as awesome. No. I I kind of liked it before just because like the scale was really really huge and the me the uh, the mechs kind of cut down on that scale and eventually they poop on everything. Right? Eventually the mechs can fly and then. <laughs> I'm apparently there. one mission away from playing. So, I'm sorry guys, I failed you all. I'm showing you the super lame, so, not flying mech. So this is the second continent you know, right? Uh, yeah. I believe so. Technically, yeah. isn't the other one the forest? Oh, no, I think you can get... It's kind of weird, you can kind of go either way. It's, so, the real weird thing about this game's design is you have a bunch of... Uh, what is it? There's a bunch of... Uh, Nope. Yeah, there he is. All right, so this is a, this is a boss. Okay. This kind of thing. Yeah, I mean, I'm in a mech, and that's gonna ruin it. Yeah. For so sense of scale. And the sense there's a no. That's me. Right. I'm gonna get him. Go get, get him. So you saw the little B thing. And that's. If you get that, something good happens. Like I. Am, it raises your morale level, which affects a lot of your skills, and it makes your teammates. Use stronger skills. So you, you probably can't see it on the video, but a lot of people in the in the bottom there's like an explanation of all the, the skills that he's using there. And so a lot of things like depend on if you're behind the guy, if you're in front of the guy. If you're not, if, if they have like some kind of status in this board. Uh, I I actually like the combat outside of the mode. Yeah. Yeah. Like, the next one is like so much stronger. You notice know, he's switching between like a gun and a sword. Um, and you, you do that quite a lot. He's killing certain skills. 
Jones. Hey, we completed the mission. Kill the guy. Yeah. Well, cool. mind you, he was level 29. And... Yeah, level like rest in peace. Three. Also, I don't know if my dudes got out of their mess. Oh, no, yeah, they did. Oh, yeah, they did. You can... Have you ever told them to get back into their mess? No, you can't. Thank you. Yeah, you didn't start uh, when you do the combat. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> my brain was like, yes! Start! Um, but yeah, this is like the desert... Oh, can you find the big ring? Let's talk about this. Let's oh, so, yeah. this is my favorite. More... You'll notice in that I got my shield. Uh, yeah. So let's see. I targeted something. And that's going to so blew off a part of it. Yeah, so right there. Sometimes it doesn't. I can lock on to a certain part. I hate this. Yeah, I don't. This is apparently a damage. It also resets all your skills. Oh, okay. So out of the mech, I actually set my uh, skills up, I think, pretty smartly. Uh. They're, they're from right to left. There are a sequence of skills hey, that all that? work together. Oh, look at that thing. Yeah, there's another mission. So this is the other type of mission, which is generally just like, kill a bunch of stuff. Because this is an offline MMO. So there's like, fight a particular guy. There's like, gather a bunch of stuff. Kill a bunch of other dudes. Like, follow like, these. Just to we'll find out when we... Whoa. Uh, Jose there. Uh, I hate him. He's kind of an ass. Actually, not the piece of the character. Because none of those characters are like, yeah, that guy's worth our time. So here's my, my big beef with them. Uh, I don't know if it's killed them. I don't think it's killed them. It might be just gather from them. I mean, clearly it's something. Yeah, something, but I don't know. No, yeah, you gotta kill four of six. Hope I didn't get in the way. Oh, no. Yeah, there you go. All right. Uh, and then there you got a uh, ranked up in a class. Oh, and now see, okay, so this game has a day-night cycle, and you list all those dudes that you were killing went away, because they don't, this is the annoying part, some of them just don't exist in night. Like, some monsters can only come out at night, some monsters only come out at day, some monsters only come out once raining. Can you kind of try and find that, uh, the giant ring in this area? Because that's a oh, cool there. Um, there it is. Yeah, you can climb it. Oh, not that one. I'm talking the one you can climb. Oh, uh, isn't that on the menu? Oh yeah, and so this your Mexican also turn into cars. Do donut rolls around you. I think it's for really, whatever reason though, this car is like real skittish. Yeah. Different mechs have different campers. Uh yeah, I think you're you're going ahead towards like south Okay. Uh you should be able to see it. Oh. Just yeah, yeah, there's weather effects as well. There it is. Over um, oh, yeah, yeah. You see it over right? yonder. So yeah, you can kinda of see it peaks over the plateau there. Never. We're gonna get in there. Ooh. Yeah, so you'll notice that like monster levels are not consistent in this game. They are just all over. The poor dude out of the mech is getting lightning bolted. Yeah. <laughs> I really despise. Yeah. Oh, there you go. So yeah, you can, you can climb up on that. Uh, just a hole. It's all in some stuff. Oh yeah, those big crystally things are like random resources. Yeah. Oh, you like can totally pick them up. This. You're not gonna be able to pick stuff up. Is a piece of treasure. Trip. Yeah, yeah, okay, cool, we got it. Yep. You have beef with my treasure gather? I do. So you can do Murphy, I need, I need to see you this. let me Turn play around. this game. Do you understand I want to get that I grab every yeah. single treasure all the time? Turn around. Oh, those, those are guys. Those are guys. Yeah, those are big guys. Run away! Yeah, you can, but you can give a, get up on them. Why do you have... What do you, what do you have to tell me what to do? Because it's cool. You got, people but, demand getting up on giant rings. I don't think they demand anything. I think you're the people. I am the people, and the people demand. There's thingies to grab. Oh, boy. Look at that, see? Did I tell you it takes me a long time to get anywhere in this game? Yeah. Did you see before it said item limit reach? Yeah. I literally have gotten to the point. Oh, no, that's, uh, you just need to update your storage. You need to spend it on your hands. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so no, that, that helps a lot. See, there's, like, this kind of this mini game where you research stuff. So, yeah, you need to something you want to do. I'm up on the thing. Ooh, look how tall you are. It's cool. Yeah, this game is actually, like, really, really pretty. It's very pretty. For a Wii U game? Definitely. 
Uh, oh, there's that guy. Ooh, so I'm gonna target his sack there. Okay, uh, Watch me turn him into Swiss cheese. Uh, let's see if we can get it. Right, yeah, I think I killed him. Yeah. I get to that sack before he's open. It's full of no Yeah, and you can actually, like, a lot of things when you blow them up, you actually, like, expose a weak part in the Yeah. You know, I hate to. I think the, the best looking area is probably the first area. Do you want me to go back? Yeah, let's go, go to Primordia, because there's some cool... Look I want to see the, the, the giant fungus of sorts, because like, that is cool. Where is that? He's just like in the... Like, just in the, really the first area you can see, like in the very first part. Which is cool, because you're, you're, you just start. Yeah. And, and there's this is already this giant, huge monster. So, the one thing I would say, though, that is kind of cool, but wears off, is that there's always big monsters, and they're roaming. And often you find yourself next to a creature that could one shot. I think he's more that way. Yeah, he's in the water. Oh, you're talking about yeah, those guys. Yeah, the really big guys. I don't think they're here. I think they're to the north. Really? They? Yeah, to the north there's those big ponds. Yeah, the big ponds. And that, yeah. that's where those dudes are. Okay. Right there. Let's see when we head that way. Yeah, I don't have flight, so I have to yeah, kind of hop yeah. up. Yeah. Flight doesn't let you... Ooh, you got there. Yeah. No! It's also a night. I don't know if... I know they come out during the day. I don't know if they're going to Don't be there when we get there. Oh. There's thingies! Oh, Mike. Mike. See, like, there's a level 65, <gasps> dude. Mike's still level 8, dude. I made it! Yeah. What's up here? Nothing. This sucks! Yeah, I know. That's the thing, like, you, you, if you ever want to get anywhere in this game, you have to, like, just let some of the blue crystals go, Mike. You got so, it. um, yeah. one thing that's kind of cool is... Oh, there's a dude. That's what he's not very you good. And me. So, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He's lost, Mike. He's lost, Mike. <laughs> Oh, oh, what hit you? Like, oh no, I turned myself into it. Oh, so you can Yeah. Jump on it. Yeah, you're dead. Uh, yeah, let's see. There's like just, like, and this is, so when I say like, we went to the first area, this is where you start. So you could be level one, and there's like a level 23 dude that you just kind of have to run around. Yeah, if they have that red eye, they literally will if they come into eyesight. Yeah, it's trying to kill me. It's not. It's uh, it, like death is not all that bad. Treasure, except if you have the mech, right. then all of a sudden money starts disappearing. You're like mm. shit. But if you die, oh, there he is. Yep. Yeah, let's see what We're that. taking him down. No, no, not. No, he'll kill you. Yeah, just immediately destroy. Look how even in my mech. Oh, oh. let's see if I can jump. Oh, uh, can jump. Oh, oh shit. Yeah. Just... I did not know that could happen. Yeah, they can just knock you out. He didn't even care. He was just like, yeah. I don't even know what that I don't even care Yeah. Like, this is kind of cool. I've never seen him walk around like this. Oh, yeah. They're, they're good up on this one. Uh, watch out. Those are level 36. I could take one. You, one? I think that's a pack of them. Yeah. But yeah, like, this is the cool part of this game. It's just uh, how big these things are. And up, look up oh, look the up there. There's a giant flying one. Yeah. Yeah, this game is really pretty. And it's really cool. There's definitely some parts that could use some work. Right. Like everything Tatsu's in there is. Mm, and all the collection of quests are pretty bad. Yeah, some of the quests are get these you see these crystals here? Yeah. This but the problem is is they follow the same rules as those enemies where some might only spawn when it's raining, some might only spawn and here's another thing that sucks. Those collection quests usually don't tell you where to go. No, they do not. They're like, go to the rock summit. And they're like, where the fuck is the rock somewhere? Right. And then you look online, and nobody has screenshots of maps, because the map's on the Wii U gamepad. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Ah, oh, it hurts me. Yeah, man. What's up, dude? Still going? Get some! Ah! <laughs> yeah, uh, see, then there's a little, little 28 guy. He's fine. And there's, look, he, he has, like, some, he's followed by, like, some little 22 mouse, mouse snakes. Well, yeah, because they know nobody's going to get near that big thing. Yeah, 
They're like, we're too small to be on its food chain. <laughs> <laughs> I think the implication is like they're like a fungus, like herbivore thing. Oh, let me zoom out the camera. Yeah. Dude, I forgot about that. You don't understand that, as I was trying to say before, is I played this on a really, really bad TV. Okay, so 90% yeah. of this, like all the words on this screen, throw them out the way. Like, they're gone. So, like, I had to figure out how to play the game without being able to... Yeah. It was like, you got, what is that, stretching locust? And I'm like, you know, it's like, look for this item. Oh, wait, hold on. He has a crazy drink. I was gonna say, I was gonna suggest like... It's like... I was gonna say, do you wanna show off the city? The city kinda sucks. Wait, we should kill this guy. Yeah, let's go for it. I think people are aggro as well. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have to aggro all of them. Oh yeah, cause you With a grenade! Boom! Wait, let's use Toxic. No, no, Toxic is not going to be used. Oh, you can get you. Yeah. God, we have this really nice view of all these next fighters. What are you doing? Yeah, yeah. yeah, also, if your skill is glowing, it means a teammate is holding out. Let's go. Okay. That's yeah, and it means that I can keep casting. And if I do enough damage within that time, it gets a lot of damage But uh doing glowing skills, uh when your teammate calls out for it, and then, like, usually the awareness. you'll get, yeah, and then you'll get health. A lot of time you get health, which is like the most important thing. Also, the little B mini game gives you health. Right. So those those are like the combat things. Uh, do we want to show them? Um, have you gotten to Kratos? Kratos? Yeah. Uh, I have gotten as far as. Yes. Sobarius. Let's go to Noctrum, Noctrum and then let's go to the other places. Well. Yeah. Doctor was not a great, but whatever. Alright. This, 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 I'm just saying, this doesn't look as cool. It's kind of cool. It's like a big jungly forest thing. Like this place. Well, that place is more like an open field. Kind right, of it's kind of a And this is like a straight up jungle. Yeah. So you're gonna tell me this ain't pretty? Yeah, it's, it's, it's not my favorite it's place. Hater of this bitch. Well, there's, so this is in the south, southern part, it's like this, right? But then the northern part, it gets kind of more, uh, I want like to open, it. yeah. Where it's just kind of like it looks kind of like the first area. It's kind of ridiculous that you can climb. Like, yeah, you can you can get off the map. Oh yeah, you definitely can. You can just swim around it. Oh, there's some quest stuff. Whoa, whoa, whoa. target him. <laughs> I'm opening up. <laughs> what is they're level like, 11 that you were level 30 in? So... <laughs> yeah, that's just like a little rabbit. I like how those players are like, I can help! I mean... Oh yeah, so one big problem that I found with this game is that you have all these characters that I don't give a fuck about, right? Right. They're all these side characters. They don't level when you don't have them in the party. Yeah, sucks. So the main characters that I'm using that I have to use are level infinity and two. And everybody else is like level ten, level twenty. And I'm like, you'll find out that uh, like what is it, Gwen or Gwen and Arena, you're gonna have to level those up. Yo, I heard that. Yeah, it's and I've been using Gwen. Okay, well there you go. Because I cheated. Yep. Alright. Fair. I totally looked online. It was things I wish I knew before I started. Yep. And that was like one of the first things. So this fight is actually a little harder than the other one. It's weird. Like, so the, the bosses guy, they kind of lie. Elite. Yeah, he's an elite. So they, they kind of they lie when you fight him. Have you ever played World of Warcraft? Oh, so here's the one. Here's the binding. No, that's a cool thing to do. 
I've never found it ultimately. Uh, I definitely killed the guy because of it. It was kind of a lower level where I was able to find him. I was just like constantly finding him and everything else. Oh my god. Let's pack some more. Yeah, let's kill this guy and then we'll come to him. Wait, wait, wait. There's, there's one thing I want to do. Okay, is there something else? Got caught up in the grenade. Now he's dead. Yep. Rest in peace. Should have stopped that one through there, pig boy. Ooh, Chris. Um. Don't judge. I'm judging. Pretty flowers. How do you want to look at the movie? Uh, it's just. Uh, the uh, the giant the giant thing, the level 60 thing. Yeah. Turn it around. Are you sure it's around? Yes, that one. Oh, no, no, you're good. Just no, turn this way. Oh, I'm just gonna look there. Right. Fine. And then we're gonna show them the other place. And uh, I just noticed the time is getting cut on. Yeah. Where are we? Oh, this is. We're not talking about the same thing. Uh, no, I'm fucked up. Oh no, yeah, yeah, there he is. He's down. There. Oh yeah, that guy. So yeah, hell, I, I definitely made the mistake of like, hey, what's that thing? Just gonna Yo, totally out there. me. I did there, and it's not a big deal unless you touch it. Yep. So you can fly yeah. around it, it's no big deal. Yeah. If you touch it, it will destroy your face. Yeah, it's like a level 60. That's a level 60 elite. There's a, so I, I have the, the flying thing, and so in this area there's also like a level 99. What? Yeah, you can't even get to another flying. Level 99? Yes. Okay, so this is like the ultimate weapon. Yeah. But does that guy give you like at least some I little shit? I don't know how different people. <laughs> I want to beat him. Level not you have to get to like level 99. Yeah, no thanks. Um, but I want to. Yeah. All right, so let's real quick. There's this is one island, and then there's one connecting to it. I haven't gotten to it because my level is not high enough. You can run there. The. Um. Yeah. Yeah. But I will show you guys this. This is like a weird biome. It's like a crystal, kind of deserty, but it's kind of, it feels like it might be cold here. Yeah, I get the same feeling. Also, the first time I came here, there was like hella fun. Yeah, there's, it, it feels like there's a lot of fungus. Fungus, fog. Yeah. Oh, to get in there and Yeah, just get, get in the car and just go as far as you can. You gotta run. Run, baby, run. I'm just gonna kill these guys a little bit. Yeah, Especially yeah. because I went into this mode and I get to free throw the grenade and do the AoE again. Yeah, so they're... I'm hitting both of them at the same time. There's like a weird, like, mech stuff that's going on here. Yeah, I don't know. I'm attacking with all my magic. So, so spoiler alert, there's also like a fire in place. Oh, is that what the last place is? Yeah, it's a fire. Okay, okay, that's cool. Yeah, I mean, there's some cool big stuff there, too. Like, I can get yeah. Uh, yeah, it's a neat little area. Like, let's just say this the story in this game is not as strong. You know what? There are parts of it that I like. Yep. You're wrong. <laughs> Hold on, Murphy. Why just don't uh, you go yourself. Yeah. Bitch? Go. Just go motorcycle mode here and just kind of get as far as you can, and then we'll, we'll call it, I guess. Okay. And then, yeah. Uh, oh, it's, uh, yeah, there's that thing that's alive now that was in the bay. Wait, what? Yes, yeah, that's the same thing. Is it real? Yeah, that's what Why? it was. Yeah, it looks like it, exactly. Yeah, but you see there's level 55 stuff, and there's level 2 stuff, and there's level 26 stuff. It's a weird game. Yeah, so it's kind of cool at first, right? Because it gives us, like, some dangerous planet kind of vibe. But it also gets a little frustrating when you're just trying to do a quick mission. Yep. Because you're like, it's really easy to, the only problem with this mission is that the enemy placement makes me, like, jump 20 times. Well, so, <clears throat> when, you're, when you're not in the Tales of Silverium, Genoblade Chronicles X, where can they find you? Uh, you can find me at Maximum Tomato, and my Instagram is at yeah. Maximum Tomato. I actually got the special edition of this game, so I'm gonna try to take a couple shots of, oh, nice. of that. Cool. You get a little thumb drive, it's like a little ship. Yeah. Cool. Um, uh, you can find me at Dork Eye Show. Uh, 
I'm very funny. Oh my girl. I was really funny in that. Whoa, whoa! The bike has butter on its wheels. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. It kind of does feel like it is. Oh, oh my god, I'm turning slightly and it's chaotic. Let's see you around now. <laughs> <laughs> 